Hi there and welcome to my little tutorial for Sports Interactive Football Manager and the question how to create config XMLs for logos. Some guys on YouTube have messaged me and I would like to show you how to create these config XMLs. So what do we need? We need this FM Graphics Configurator. This tool is uh, one of the best yeah, programs for this. Uh, you can also use the FM Server XML Configurator or you can uh, use maybe also the FM Graphics Guru but um, FM XML, the standard tool for um, face packs, isn't working uh, quite as good because there are some options missing. Basically you can open any um, config XML from your files and I will show you that for the club background logos now. Yep, clubs, background and here left. And then we go d right straight down to the config XML and open it with a normal text editor. And once it is opened we can see how the structure of this XML is. So uh, what we now have to do is to rebuild this config XML with our tool and this is quite easy. We are here club background logos and left so we open this tool get to this path copy it via copy and paste or we, you can browse also and now we um, we have to decide that these are title bars yeah this is the don't uh, don't get misled misled by the naming title bars are the same as backgrounds and title bars and these are title bars for clubs and these are for the left side so we click right on this press proceed process and we're done and now we can open it again and it's still the same structure here and we are ready for with the title bars on the left side so we can do this also for club backgrounds on the right side and also f for example for the small t small logo ones and these look like this graphics pictures club icon so we select um, logos small clubs choose the path Oops. and press process and that's basically it for this you have to um, you have to watch uh, you have to take care of the normal normal logos twice because there are as I can show you here two um, two sizes which uh, which will be created in one config XML, it's the normal uh, normal size and the huge size, which uh, isn't in in any use since FM09, I think. I don't know. So you have to create it twice. So what do you do? You first create um, a normal normal s normal config XML. So we are in clubs, normals, and then we press normal. Okay, now we open the config XML and now we copy the whole list. Yeah, you see this without the list tags. We copy this, close the XML, and now we um, process once again, same path, and now huge clubs. Okay and we open this and we paste it right here in front of this okay and now we can save this file uh, data and save or uh, control and s and close it and we are done with the club logos same goes for um, competition logos you can uh, create competition logos right uh, as the club logos just choose competitions normal small and so on and yeah, beware of the fact that you have to do 
logos, um, the normal logo size and huge logo size twice and overwrite the config XML once again and copy the uh, normal sized uh, entries once again after that. Um, a last word to the nations. Um, you can just choose nation backgrounds uh, like um, uh, wait, I show you for Germany. This is the nation background for Germany. You see, it is the um, federation logo of the German Football Federation (DFB), and uh, yeah, you can do this norm the background logos as as you ever like. You can also use um, uh, flag backgrounds if you want to, uh, if you want to uh, flags, and yeah, just choose nations and then uh, uh, title bars left and right just as shown for the clubs but a very important message to you for the normal logos um, uh, no, 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 not the normal logos but the small logos you can choose normal nations here and huge nation logos of course and this will bring you mm, the normal federation logo. But if you want to have small flags and uh, you have to be careful, you don't you can't you can only have either small flags or small federation logos. You cannot have both at the same time. So you have to choose do you want do you want the small flags or do you want the small federation logos? I prefer the small flags, but if you prefer um, uh, federation logos, well, you have to choose small nations here. You cannot you cannot have um, uh, both at the same time. This is a bit tricky. So, <coughs> regarding flags, I have here um, this flag pack, and it looks like this graphics pictures nation icon. Yeah, so just create it like nations small and these are, these are the small logos, the small flags. Um, yeah, and if you ask yourself how to create normal flag sizes, well, this looks like this. Graphics, pictures, nation, flag. Unfortunately, there aren't, uh, there isn't this flag option, so you have to create this flag uh, config XML by yourself or use an existing, uh, so there are several flag packs um, yeah, within the internet and you can see um, yeah, and use, use any flag pack you like. So it's your choice, small flags or small configuration logos and that's basically all for it uh, for the day. Just uh, renew the config XMLs, uh, copy and replace huge and normal sized logos and yeah that's basically it if you have any further questions well feel free to ask them in the youtube comments or leave me a message or well we we'll see you and have a good day bye